As we taste our way across beautiful Bay City, we're going to visit a coffee shop that's also a museum. We'll have some fantastic fried chicken and maybe go to the beach. You know we're going to try an incredible Bloody Mary, plus devour some of Michigan's best pizza, all during our Michigan's Best Day in Bay City. all over the world oh. and all over Michigan are coming here to Beatles and Bean because they just love what you're doing. Oh, of course they do. They travel for hours and hours every day. It's just an incredible experience. Not only do we have some of the coolest and specialty beverages on the planet, the theme here is just a total attraction. Now we're here to share it with everybody. Yes. You know, you come on in, you refresh yourself, and you get this experience. GX House Restaurant. You guys are one of our picks for Michigan's best fried chicken. How long have you guys been in business? Be 40 years next year. So we've been doing it a long time and same recipe, same people. Some of the same help still here. So that's why I was just talking to someone in the back. She's been here, what, 37, 37 years? 37 years. We're like a Bay City institution here at Cruise GX. We try. A lot of good food keeps them coming back. Okay, well, let's talk about this buffet. Because we do it every on day. my mind, this is the best deal in Bay City, hands down. How much is this buffet? Eight ninety nine. You get the whole hot bar buffet. We got everything on here. We got chicken wings. We have honey fried chicken, baked chicken, pierogies. Everything's from scratch, just like you'd make at home. And I'm gonna take all the chicken. <laughs> uh, let's dive in. Let's. Why wait? Uh, yeah, I'm ready. Look at that glaze. Chicken though is really moist. Stick right to you. Which is really good because it's on a buffet out here, right? So I love it. It's still moist. And it's still, and it's still crispy. Yeah, how many pounds of chicken do you go through in, a, in like a day? On the average, probably about 70, 100 pounds. On the weekends. What? And the, and, and the weekends is crazier, you know? Top notch. Well done. There you go. <laughs> Way to go, Donnie. There you go. Glad you guys made it in. It's great. All right, Amy, welcome home. It's so good to be back. <laughs> At Bay City Bills, you know, it right? Fits, it fits us. Let's and go. we fit right in here. We fit right in here. <laughs> I know we're here for a Bloody Mary, but it does say the shot of the month is a raspberry fizzy. Yeah, we we'll probably have to try that too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and the other thing, remember this Bloody Mary comes with a snit. It does, it should come with a snit. It yeah, does come if, with a snit. If we remember correctly. It does. Red Hot. You like Red Hot. You like it spicy. I like it spicy. I would actually have this even spicier. But the no. pickle juice to me is, that's that's the key to the, to a really, yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> to a really great Bloody Mary. You put that pickle juice in there, plus it's restorative. Then it's like adult Gatorade. <laughs> Cheers. Woo. Oh yeah. Mix that up because I got a little bit of the vodka. <laughs> You got all that. Oh well, hello, Bay City. Deb, thank you for that healthy pour. Ahoy, mateys. I think Permission to come aboard, <laughs> Captain. <laughs> Permission granted. Whoa, hell. <laughs> So what is that supply that you go to, you think? Just supplies it out? Oh my gosh, couldn't even fit in there. This is where you put the, the shells shell in. in. Oh, and is that where all the shells are down there? So Jackie, we've been coming here for several years now. And you have and we love Muscle Beach. You take food to the next level. This place has been here since, as far as back as we know, is at least the 50s, could be the 40s. Yeah. 
We opened here in um, May of 2003 with my family. We were the we were the entire staff. This is some of our summer fare. We've always done the homemade fries and the homemade onion rings. Yeah. Well, one of these days, we're going to do a search for Michigan's best onion ring. <laughs> these are going to be hard to beat. So we're going to put this to the test right now. They just came out fresh. I have no idea what to expect. Yeah. <laughs> it should just be a perfect bite. There you huh? go. Huh? And then we have our coney dogs that <laughs> keep people coming. These coney dogs are, are award-winning, some of the best in the state of Michigan. And then um, ice cream. You saw a little bit of ice cream here at Muscle Beach? Oh, just a little. <laughs> What, but this is what Michigan is best really is all about, finding those hidden gems, places you wouldn't think about when you're traveling the state of Michigan. It's absolutely incredible. It's such a step above what you would expect. I love it. It feels like a birthday party. Oh, it is a party. <laughs> <laughs> this right. is crazy. We're going to go for it. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> We're at D'Angelo's Pizzeria here in Bay City. Love this place. Just love this place. Yeah, and this is a place that you've been to even more than me because they were actually on the very first search for best pizza, right? Yes, correct. In 2013, we did best pizza, and then you and I, of course, went back on the road in 2016. Uh, but I just love the passion. David Baranowski, the chef here, has a lot of passion for food. The thing about Chef David is he's, he's so creative and like you said, cares so much about the food, but he, he really takes it to a whole different level. He's making everything homemade. He cares about people too, that's the other thing. He's a vegan himself and he has a huge vegan part of the menu, but he loves meat eaters too, so he's got a whole range. I mean, it's a huge menu to choose from. Why did you want to open D'Angelo's in Bay City? What is it about this community that makes it great? The people, they're very passionate. And I'm from around here, so it's just, I just like the area. How has the community received D'Angelo's? It's almost like a cult-like following that we have. People are extremely passionate. You add vegans to our, our following and they're extremely passionate. But you yourself started to go down the path of vegetarianism and, and veganism. Yep. And you decided to add it to the menu. Yes, burgers, pizzas, tacos. With a, with a lot of good taste and flavor. Cheers. <laughs> so that's how you spend a Michigan's best day in Bay City. From some incredible coffee in a Beatles museum, some of Michigan's best fried chicken, great Bloody Marys, awesome ice cream treats, and some of Michigan's best pizza, Bay City is a pretty great place to spend the day. For more on Michigan's best, go to MLive.com.